Welcome to this Operations Bridge video tutorial. In this video, you will learn how to create a parameterized performance dashboard. A parameterized dashboard is useful if you have many instances on a single CI, such as multiple disks on a node. It lets you easily visualize the data for a selection of instances. It also allows the same dashboard to be used with other CIs that might have a different set of instance names. We will create this dashboard, which is based on business transaction response time that comes via the OBM integration with APM. A transaction can be measured from multiple locations, so each location is a different instance. Start by creating a basic dashboard that contains a chart with the metrics of interest. Since we are dealing with multi-instance data, select one of the instances as a temporary placeholder and click Back to Dashboard. Click Configure Dashboard and in the Parameterization tab, add a parameter. Give the parameter a name that describes the type of instances. Select the same data source and class as earlier. Execute the default regular expression to show all instances for the CI. Click Add to add the parameter to the dashboard. And Close to finish working in Configure Dashboard. The Location parameter displays the instances that you can select for graphing. The final step is to edit the chart to use the selected instances. Change the instance name from the hard-coded instance to the parameter. Response time from both selected locations is now displayed, but the default metric label shows the same name for each. Since the metric name is in the title, it isn't needed in the label as well, so change the label to at at instance name in uppercase letters, which is a substitution variable. To avoid the long instance names being truncated in the legend, go to Axis and Grid and click Table. To also see the average response time for the instance over the selected time range, click to display the average value. Specify that the response time values are in milliseconds to automatically display the optimal time unit conversion. Go back to Dashboard and save it. You can now choose which location instances to display in the chart. When you select a different business transaction CI, you can choose the location instance names specific to that CI. To learn more about Performance Dashboard, see the OBM online help and search for Designing Performance Dashboard.